In the SVI architecture, our zone controllers have not only the gatewaying purpose, but also the powering of all devices in a car. And it does that by integrating various types of drivers. And one of these drivers is the E-Fuse. The advantage of the E-Fuse is that it combines the characteristics of a classical wired fuse with an integrated driver circuit. That allows us to not only monitor and control the current that flows, but also to simulate the temperature of the wire that carries the current. To do this, the wire diameter and the desired characteristics of the fuse are programmed with external components. This allows us to use smaller wire diameters for components with a high inrush current and thus save weight and money. But still, the wire is protected against overheating and the load against overloading. To demonstrate this to you, we added a load to the demonstrator that is connected with a wire that is too small to the front left zone controller. And if I activate that load by pressing this button here, you see that the button is switched on. And now the load is drawing current, but the current is too high for the wire, so the wire heats up. The E-Fuse recognizes that by integrating the i squared t curve and simulating the wire temperature. And as soon as the wire temperature gets too hot, it switches off the load, protecting the wire and the load itself. In contrast to a classical fuse that has to be exchanged, we can reactivate the fuse in software by accessing the GUI of our bench. So if I now reactivate the fuse, I can start the load again. 